Question number 24, part A, Plasmodium vivax and Plasmodium ovar are transmitted by a mosquito. State with the reason whether the two organisms can interbreed. Uh, so you can say that they can interbreed because they belong to the same genus. Uh, they can interbreed because they belong to the same genus. A uh, genus is a, large, is a large number of organisms. It is zebra, horses, uh, 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 zebra, horses, donkeys and such. That's a genus. Uh, so again, uh, they cannot interbreed. Interbreed. They cannot interbreed uh, because they belong to different. Uh, they belong to different. Species, uh, different species. Uh, so that's uh, another reason they cannot interpret. Uh, so species, organism with similar characteristics. So they don't belong to the same uh, species. But B of the question, we have to explain the evolutionary basis for ever-changing drugs for malaria treatment. So the malaria causing parasite uh, keeps on mutating. Malaria causing parasite uh, keeps on mutating. Keeps on mutating and becomes resistant and becomes resistant and becomes uh, drug resistance uh, over time. Uh, this makes it necessary necessary To discover new drugs, to discover new drugs, to cater for new emerging, new emerging uh, stains of parasites. So that's why, why uh, we, the drugs keep on changing because the parasites also keep on mutating, causing uh, new parasites which cannot be uh, taken care of the current drugs. That's we, the, the new drugs must keep on uh, being discovered to cater for that. And that's how you use that question. You answer that question, you get four marks.